Welcome to Amateur Students to Class today on this Friday the 5th. Hope you guys are doing well today. Let's jump into our announcements quickly. We will have a test on Tuesday. Test on Tuesday. At this time, please turn your homework in from yesterday. Stop. Make sure your name is on it, please, and turn that in. in oh, by the way, a lot, of, a lot of you might have turned this in already. I was not here to pick up the folders yesterday. I was at the state tournament. So if you turn it in already, that's fine. Now, incomplete. Um, let's see here. Vivian and Haley, now if, if either one of you finished your test yesterday, that's fine, but if not, you must finish it today. Of course, Elizabeth, you've got your incompletes here. Please be working on those, okay? Now, Cooper, I gave you an extra day, and to be honest, since I did not pick up my uh, folder yesterday, you could still turn this in today if you would like to, okay? If you didn't turn it in yesterday. Brianna, I hope you took your quiz yesterday, but if you did not, you got kind of lucky, you can take it today if you need to, okay? Um, Jimmy and Elizabeth, let's see. Now, this one does have to be turned in by today. Uh, Elizabeth, you were in class on Monday. So, Jimmy, Elizabeth, of course, Jimmy isn't here. So, Elizabeth, please turn this in today, or it will be a permanent zero, okay? All right, moving on. If you're in the room on the day of a test or a quiz, you will take it unless you contact me before the class period starts. Now today, we're going to take a quiz and we're going to review for Tuesday's test. There will be no fill in the blanks on this test. However, it will still be a two-day test. It is a tough test. Now let me talk to you about the test calendar. There is an online test calendar where teachers have to put their tests on the calendar. That way students never have more than two tests per day. If you ever have more than two tests, you need to talk to your teachers. One of them should not be giving you a test, okay? There's an online calendar, so there's no way I can put your test on Tuesday and then also put your test on Wednesday. That would be hogging the calendar, and that's not fair to other teachers. So, if you have two other tests on Wednesday, um, I understand that, but um, you still will have to finish the test on Wednesday. So, what I'm saying is, is study well for Tuesday's test, okay? And then you'll take it on Tuesday. Sorry for yawning, and you'll also take it on Wednesday, okay? All right, moving on. Um, here's the review sheet information. Please copy that down. Quite a big review sheet. There's the help videos. A total of, what, 86 minutes, I believe. So, I mean, I'm giving you two class periods, so that's not too bad, okay? Today and Monday. All right, and let's go over today's quiz. So please pause the video, Miss Carol, pass out the quiz, and then restart it once everyone has a quiz on their desk. Okay, number one and two, fill in the blanks. Number three, find the length of arc AB. Number four, find the circumference of the circle. Number five, determine that, well, I can't read that out loud, but um, it's a word problem there, so please work on that. And then lastly, now number six says, find the area of the region. The circle looks like this. The region I want you to find the area of is this region right here. Okay, that piece of pie-shaped region. Find the area of that region. Okay, that's it, guys. Um, please get to work on your quiz and your review sheet. Have a great weekend. Contact me if you have any questions at all.